All righty, we are back again. I'm back like a bad penny. <laughs> I can't find my tape runner. Oh, there it is. Well, that's one of them. I don't know where I put the other one. I put it away in a safe place. <laughs> All right, we are here with my year 2017 and we are gonna do a little mini collage in my June spread for the month. And our prompt for this month over in my year 2017 is growth. And you, um, if you're not a member of the group and you don't know what the heck I'm talking about and you want to be a member of the group, it's a year-long journaling program and sort of, you know, um, exploring yourself and your life kind of a thing. And it is um, over on Facebook and the link is in the description below so you can join us over there. All right, that being done, this is my June insert to my traveler's notebook. I'm actually filming this in May, so that's why this is not in my traveler's notebook. Um, and my traveler's notebook sometimes gets really thick, so it's easier sometimes to work with these if I'm home outside the book. All right, um, we did make a little travel journal as part of our June prompt, and I could do this in here, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna actually do it in here. Um, and I'm gonna do a little mini collage and I'm gonna do it in real time. I'm going to um, not speed forward through it or anything like that. I did pull a few images out um, from my stash. This is a little, um, I think this is from an old National Geographic. I think it's from a painting. And I was actually thinking about cutting her apart, but you know what? I think we're gonna leave her the way she is and we're gonna just put her down that way. I usually use glue stick or tape runner or something like that, dry glue. Occasionally, if I'm putting in a thicker object, I'll use a wet glue or a gel medium or even staples. But first, let's get her in here. And I do think I want her like right about here. There we go. I have, um, I, I pulled this quote out of my box. I was looking for something else. This stood out to me. I've been talking this month in June about um, growth, um, growing yourself in your art, growing yourself in your faith, growing yourself in your belief in yourself. And this said, make it sweet to be yourself. That just stood out to me. So we're going to cut that out a little neater than I did when I initially cut it. <laughs> and we are going to stick that in because I love that. Make it sweet to be yourself. And I do think I want to, this is one of my melted metal uh, paste embellishments. It's half of one of the citrus slices. So I think we're gonna put that in too. First, let's put the quote in. And we're going to put the orange slice in. Okay, I have a bunch of little stickers that we're going to use. <clears throat> I have these flowers that somebody sent to me and we're about growth this month and one of the things that, of course, the obvious one that that makes me think of is the growth of nature and flowers. And um, like with last month, uh, the blooming of uh, the new growth of spring and, you know, baby birds and all of that stuff. So we are going to use these here. I've got this whole sheet. It would be fun to just use them all up. So I think we're going to try and do that. I'm not sure where these came from. I do think they were from Happy Mail from somebody. They might be from my friend Cindy Utter. I don't remember. And I'm not the most organized of souls when it comes to these things. So if I was more organized, I would actually put your names on stuff as it comes in. But yeah, I'm not. <laughs> so... Now, I do think I want to take maybe some of these and put them on another part of this page. Kind of 
kind of cluster them together, right? I like that. I had some other stickers here too, but I just like using those. Those, those are cute. And I like the way that looks a lot. Um, I could take... Um, I don't know if I want to do anything else. I think I want to just do some journaling. Which I think I'm going to do, yeah. Never be afraid to grow into who you are truly meant to be. I love that. I also have this um, embellishment that I made in April, um, and it has the strengths in your character will bring you serenity on it. And I love the way these little things turned out. If you didn't see me doing these and you would like to know, how did she do that? I'll try to remember to link the video in the description. If I forget, somebody remind me in the comments. <laughs> And yeah, it wouldn't be the first time I forgot to link something, so <laughs> I want to put this in here. The question is where. I kind of want to put it here. And I do think we're going to just staple it. It's kind of on the heavy, thick side. Staples are easy. And I like the sort of industrial look of having it stapled in. So there you go. I want you to just think about having some fun with your signature this month and whatever symbolism for you represents growth, use it in your journal or in your signature if you're working in a traveler's notebook like me, whatever you're working in this month. Have that theme in the back of your mind and use it in your book. All right, that's it for today. I will um, be back soon. Have fun and enjoy the process. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, um, don't forget to leave them here in the comments or message me over in the Facebook group. Check out the video description for links and the store, my Etsy store link and all that stuff. And uh, the most important thing is to go out and have a great day and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys.